there we go that should uh, be going live in just a second I'm just currently going to stick on my headphones so we can actually hear I put out an announcement so people actually know we're going live so let us jump straight back into things because I've been enjoying this playthrough so far and it's been quite nice that we've been doing it all on stream because, you know, it means that we actually get to talk about what's going on. And, you know, it's quite nice. Anyway, fellas. We're going to continue. It's Arseface, a.k.a. Emperor Ming, a.k.a. lots of things. He has many names at this point. It's a good cup of tea. Good cup of tea. I'm going to be uploading the rest of the series um, tonight, hopefully. I've got them all encoded. So we should be uh, able to enjoy some... Uh, some stuff. Anyway, fellas, where were we? We were, last of what I remember, we had uh, just completed a few quests. Welcome, uh, Red Panda, and welcome Dragon Troop Beta to the uh, to the stream now. I'm trying to remember what we were doing, but we have the Mohawk. Where, where, did we, where did we actually need to go? I suppose we can... Which, we needed money, didn't we? So let's go do some quests. Let's, uh... Start off today by going to the Heroes Guild and taking some quests, because, you know, we need to do some quests. Yes. Bowerstone Weast. Exactly. Perfect. Anyway, what we'll do is we we'll head to the Guild, uh, and we'll see if we can level up a tool, and then we will, um, we will, uh, try and, you know, we can't afford any level ups, really. I think we already leveled up, um, and we will see if there's any quests we can do. So... Break the siege. Break a siege in Knothole Glade. A lost trader or the trader massacre. Break the siege in Knothole Glade. We'll do that, shall we? Welcome, Pixblocks. We're going to break the siege. Uh, you're from the 32-bit server. Welcome to the stream of a lifetime where today you'll be witnessing us do some quests for money to do some other stuff because that's what we do. Uh, don't use any aggressive magic. Do this quest without any assistance from any guards. Except, kill the bandit siege leader. You know, we'll do that as well. Alright, there we go. We've taken some boasts. Let us begin our quest. So, where is it we need to go? We need to head to... Who's this guy? I'm looking for someone to this take guy, to from earlier. We'll take deal, this guy, see? won't we? Because, you, you know, the female, you know, it works out quite rest, in our, well in our favour if we take him. One piece, just... So uh, we'll take this dude. We'll take this dude to uh, Orchard oh, Farm first take, of all. Use your, when we, if you want me, oh, but the, try, I'm pretty sure this guy has already died twice before when we way, tried hero. this, or it might have only been once before. Either way, he's definitely died in the uh, in the past. But that's not what matters. What matters now is um, is that we're going to go do the the actual quest for once. Well, not the actual quest, but we're going to head on our way to the quest. So let's um, get this trader to follow us. Um, I just moved my chair down slightly yes. so I can, I'm this more on par like with the, right the... Okay, so there's already some bandits that have been, uh, brutally murdered by, um, by the bandits. Luckily, these bandits are not too t tough anymore because, you know, nowadays we actually have weapons compared to before where we, uh, we didn't really have weapons. We just sort of rushed in with a stick. You know, now we can actually battle our way through. Uh, I'm, oh no, that is not good. Uh, he's attacking our trader, dude. We'll slow down time. We'll take him out. Uh, and then, you know, hopefully this guy will uh, not die this time. Or not get injured. Last time he was complaining because he, um, we escorted him. And he arrived completely covered in, like, cuts and bruises and whatever else he was complaining about. Either way, you know, we'll just run through. We'll clear out this area. You know, we got some, some wasps picking a fight on some traders. You know, all the usual stuff that you're used to in, uh, in Bowerstone. Bowerstone? Bloody, no, Darkwood place thing. Greatwood. This is Greatwood. Greatwood's the nice place, which is like, you know, all eerie and, you know, as the fact is it is covered in bandits and weird giant mutate bug things, but once you get past that, it's actually quite nice. Okay, there we go. So we already uh, we already got everything over there. Let's go get our trader guy. We'll go drop him off in uh, Orchard Farm, because, you know, he wants to go to Orchard Farm, so we'll go drop him off. Uh, and yeah, we will begin, we will go rescue and stop the siege over in, uh, Knothole Glade, uh, which is important. I'm right with you. What's down here then? Have we, uh, already got everything down here? I, we might have, unless there was a secret thing here? I don't know. Either way, we'll, we'll, we'll ditch that. So how's everyone doing today in chat? How's everyone? What a man. What? 
Oh no, they're cheering for me. See, I'm not used to that. You want to know what Emperor Ming does to people that cheer? I can't run as quickly as you can. Okay, we'll walk extremely slowly for you. We've already cleared the path ahead. All right. They're just cheering. They never stop. Okay, this way to. Uh, I think it's this way to. Yeah, if the statue and lookout point. Yeah, that's the thing. It's all about lookout point. This entrance is closed for repairs. It's not closed for repairs. We know it's not closed for repairs. Well. We're here, and not a scratch on me. No, there's oh, not. You've earned this gold. Oh, and here's a bonus for the hard work. There, we got a bonus. 370, that's nothing. You know, we don't often, you know, endorse murder. But, oh, that was close. You're sponsoring a small uh, op Overwatch Open Division team. Well, thank congratulations on sponsoring a team. That's mighty impressive. Uh, we'll head to Knothole Glade and we'll we'll break this siege that we've been asked to stop. You know, we need to go do this. Emperor Ming has been asked to defeat all the bandits and he needs the money so he can buy a, be a bigger sword because he needs the biggest swords. Halt! Halt. So you're the hero they sent, eh? Well, I've got a new job for you. What's These the job? Bloody villagers are holding our boss and They're they holding him. Hang him. They want to hang the boss. So I want you to take a message to their chief. You tell him we'll raise his precious town to the ground if he doesn't hand our boss back. I'm doing all right, thank right you. Well, run along then. We haven't got all day. Okay, so this guy sent me on some quest to apparently be nice mm. to the bandits. Uh, but I don't want to do that. I'm going to go, you know, be nice to the... Uh... I'm going to go rescue the... Um... Well, I'm going to save the people and take out the bandits because that's what we, that's what we said we'd do. He's plundered this village for far too long. Exactly, he keeps plundering, and we can't be having plundering. Hill by the tavern, and that's where he's staying. So you'll just have to go back out there and get rid of the scum's bandit friends. Okay, that's Talk what we're paid for. Over there when you're ready, and he'll open the gates for you. As I'm for quiet. Me, I'm I shouldn't be quiet. I've um. Good luck. That won't stop you from watching the stream. Welcome to the stream. Now this is the best stream because we've just been asked to take out all these bandits. Yeah, <laughs> screw the diplomacy. There is no need for diplomacy. Look, we said that we would do this quest without any assistance from any guards, uh, and we said we'd also kill the bandit siege leader. So, uh, first of all, let's, um, I mean, we need to kill the bandit siege leader first of all, don't we? So, whereabouts is he? Is he down here or is he up here? Where do we go? Do we talk to this guy first? We haven't had any food deliveries for days now. Things are getting rather ugly in here. There we go. So they're hungry. So we need to give the people food. Alright, we'll go outside and deal with them. You're Open the gates. You're going to take them on all by yourself? You're a real hero. Or a real fool. Not a real well, then, fool. Let's get started. I'm going to do it all by myself, because that's exactly what we said we'd do. My volume shouldn't be low. My volume's as high as it you always is. You can try turning up the stream. Get those bandits before they free their leader. I like the way they're just slowly walking over in the background. So now we'll just slow down time. <laughs> Alright guys. We are, we've slowed down time because we're magical. You know, you might not be used to this, but here's a magical spell that will uh, teach you all a goodbye. There we go. This is how you do it, fellas. Okay. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. These guys are relatively tough, actually. Damn, they hit hard. Not as hard as the bloody arena. The arena was difficult. This is, uh, you know, this is a piece of pie in comparison. Since doing the arena, you know, we've, we've, we've been Oh, no! They're, they're... Ah! They're actually gonna free the, um, the bloody, um... They're... There's a horn? Well, does that mean there's Balverines coming? Or... No, we can't... We are not, uh... This is not our, the type of situation we want to be involved with. Wait, did I fail? Well, that could have gone better, eh? I hope you weren't expecting a reward. What did I do wrong? The bandit prisoner has died. Right. Well, we're not meant to roger the bandit boss, apparently. All right, we'll get... <laughs> <laughs> only I could, only I could mess that up. All right, we'll we'll do this again. So we actually want to get out. Uh, all right, let us out. Uh, open the gates. Tell us we're insane. And this time we can't let them. We can't let them mess him over. We need to stop them before they get any further. So 
We want to get all rid of all these guys, you know, with the old razzle dazzle. And then we will um, give the old magic spell thing that we do while the others try and run through. You know, we've actually got a tactic this time. And the tactic is get some cash. All right, this guy, for some reason, is still alive. Now, this guy looks like he means business. So does that other guy behind us. Okay, now it's these guys we want to watch out for. Um, okay, I'm going to use a potion. Now I'm going to slow down time. I'm going to run up. Now, we want to deal with these guys because, you know, otherwise they sort of try and take out the bandit king or they don't try and take him out, they try and rescue him. I mean, the guards are doing a complete and utter awful job. Uh, there's a guy running up behind the guard. That guard is standing by the gates doing absolutely nothing. Okay, that dude was not friendly. He did just... Alright, is that all of them dealt with? Yes, this time he hasn't told us that we did awful. Nice work. Those bandits won't be back in a hurry. I like the static clapping in the background. It's brilliant, isn't it? <laughs> did that guy just run away screaming? That's brilliant. Ah! Why are they all... What? Oh dear. Oh dear. What's happened? Hey! Oh dear. Oh dear. <laughs> They're scared of the little uh, scorpion dude. Oh dear. They'll punch our little scorpion fella to death so he stops screaming. You are right there, mate. I think he's feeling a little bit better. What's going on in town? Should we go see what's uh, happening in the good old not whole glade? we got a crunchy chick. we got a will potion, which is actually somewhat useful. What else is going on, on up here? we got the, the bard in the pub. You know, no one's actually at their jobs because everyone's scared of the bandit siege. So we're probably gonna have to come back later. All right, we'll uh, <laughs> we'll head on over to uh, Barrowfields. We'll actually continue along with some main quests now. You know, we made our seven grand off that questing, and we needed seven grand because we just well we need, we're saving up for a new quest, aren't we? We want the we've we already got fifty thousand, fifty-seven thousand. Seeking revenge for his death, they have hired a band of highly skilled assassins to kill you. Be on the lookout for surprise attacks. No. Surprise attacks on this guy. They'll never get us. As an archer is impressive, hero. You should try your skill at the archery range near Nothole Glade. Should we? We should try our skill at the archery range near Nothole Glade. Um, but before we do that, we are... Fellas. You know what? Sod it. We're going to go do some extra quests. We can't be asked with this main storyline. We want the big fuck-off sword. And why do we want it? No, we can't be asked to meet the woman. We want the big fuck-off sword before we do any of that. Because the big fuck-off sword, look, our dude is, he needs it. What other quests can we do? The lost trader, that's not enough money. Kill all the guards and traders in Barrow Fields. I mean, we do want the money. Or do we do this one? We'll do this one. Although, trader massacre. Kill all the guards and traders in Barrow Fields. Do we do it? Do we murder everyone? We'll do it. We're doing it. We, You know, we don't mean to be evil, but you know, there's a time and there's a place to do everything. So we're going to do the quest. And we're going to do it all. Uh, we're going to uh, complete the quest in under four minutes. We're going to ensure the bandit doesn't die. We're going to do... We're going to do the entire thing naked. You know. Okay. And we're going to head off and we're going to do... Oh, we're going to... No, don't follow us. If you follow us, we will murder you. So don't do it, fellas. All right, we're going to head to uh, Barrowfields. And we're going to massacre the entire population for the sake of money. Because, you know, Arseface is the hero of the centuries. You're here. About time to. Yes, we look scarier I'm than you. I'm afraid some of the lads couldn't wait and got stuck in early. Did they? So let's hurry up and join them while there's still some traders left. All right, we have four minutes oh, to do this and mission. Don't be taking no prisoners, because we've got enough of them. They've already. got enough prisoners, so uh, our job is to kill all the guards and traders in Barrow Fields, ensure none, of, ensure the bandit doesn't die, do the quest naked, and complete the quest in under four minutes. Perfect. All right, fellas, we're on our way. Step one, you know, we got to ensure that the bandit doesn't die. How do we do that, I hear you ask? Slow down time, whack all the guards to death with the big old sword. This isn't the, the good old big sword, though. This is not the sword that we're going to have soon. Oh, crap, they hit hard. Alright. They just work here. I feel bad. You know, they're just, they're on about just working here, but at the end of the day, you know, we just work here too. It's not our fault that we have to complete this quest in under four minutes. Oh, no, I feel kind of bad, but, you know... 
It's all, <laughs> all in a good day's work. <laughs> Plus, if a dude in a mohawk wearing these boxes came up to you, I wouldn't exactly plan on hanging around. Pretty morbid, actually. That's the guy that reported us to the police earlier, though, so, you know, it's not all too bad. All right. We've got 13 of these guys left to take out, and then we'll be done. We've still got three minutes, and we're going to get paid a lot of big bucks for this. So, you know, it's worth. it'll be worth it at the end of the day. Okay, come on. There we go. I feel kind of bad. But then again, we're getting paid so much cash for this, does it really matter? Because in the wise words of, uh, I don't know, Steve Jobs, is it worth being evil for a little bit of cash? Yes. And then he invented the iPod Nano. True story. Uh, at least I have no way to clarify it, but, you know, it sounds like something feasible. Okay, we've been knocked to the floor, but, you know, there's only a few of these guys left. Holy hell, they hit hard. All right. Yeah, these guys really do hit uh, hit the spot. And by hit the spot, I mean they hit us. And the spot being most of us. All right, fellas, we're going to get through this. Ooh. All right, there we go. This is the heroic mode for anyone new that's watching. Uh, and the heroic mode makes the game much, much, much harder. As in, um, this game goes from being incredibly easy to uh, incredibly difficult with the hard mode enabled. So we've got a couple of these guys to take out, and we've got 1 minute 55 left to do it in. So, uh, oh wait, we've only got one of them left. And he's over there. Oh, that's actually a bandit. Okay, fellas, we're going to do this. I'm telling you. The things we'll do for a bit of cash. You can't do this. You've got a family. We can't do this. That's what they all say. Little do they know Emperor Ming is a cruel but Look, merciful here, god. Lads. one trying to sneak off into Oakvale. Why don't you do the honours, hero? <laughs> Please don't kill me. I ain't done nothing. I have a family. He has a shop. A shop. Oh. Uh. No, we'll allow him. You gutless guild puppet. I guess we'll have to deal with this one ourselves then. <laughs> Just calmly walks away. That's nice, isn't it? We got seven grand for that. That was easy money. All right, I don't think we're... There's still a guy left up here. <laughs> All right, mate. What's going on? I was going to make a nice pile of gold out of that mushroom. Now we'll never be able to afford that trip to Madame Minch's. That's a shame. We gave it to a small kid, if that's anything else. All right, let's, um, let's, let's put back on our armor, because we're probably going to have to go somewhere else, and we'll go actually continue on with the quest. You know, because we're heading this way... And... Oh, we didn't actually put on the armor because of how brilliant this menu system is. I want to get a new hat. We don't have a hat. We just have, um... Plate mail suit. There we go. Uh, we don't actually own a hat, which is a shame. Like, we got a bandana. We have a helmet. We don't have a hat. I want, like, a, a top hat. I haven't done the bordello quest yet, but when we do the bordello quest, we get the pimp hat, don't we? So, we'll get the pimp hat. Because I do see Emperor Ming as a pimp. He's got very pimpish tendencies, you know, the way he's incredibly old. Uh, and, you know, his life mostly consists around uh, really, 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 really... Well, nothing, really. Doesn't matter how many times I say really, you can't exactly make him more interesting than a damp spoon. Alright, so we've arrived. And what's the biz? Let's find out. Let's gonna have a drink of water while so, this all happens. you finally met Jack of Blades. Yeah, we met him I at the met arena. Long ago, of course, when he burned down our home and cut out my eyes. That's not very pleasant, is it? he wasn't lying when he said he knew where mother was. He's was he not? So you felt I wouldn't want to see this fella's mother rain, because you know she'd I probably be as hideous as he is. Inside, but the archaeologist knows of an ancient secret passage. You've met him already, haven't you? Jack's creatures are still after him. Just like they're after me. They're after me as well. Yeah, we uh, we just had to massacre an entire village because of that. Definitely, definitely wasn't out of the call of money. I can't stay here much longer. I've left the details. In she, I, I know she's blind, but does she know where we are? <laughs> she's talking to the wrong direction. The only one who knows how to reach the sword. Yes, we need the sword. You did read the book I sent, didn't you? The sword is everything. Yes, we know the and sword of eons. We would read your book. Oh, in the last and episode has a gift for you too more power than you can imagine i don't want more power we for more quests <laughs> i love that i love that this really morbid scene check the guild for more quests 
All right, we'll find out what's going on over here. Should we give a? We'll go for a little bit of an adventure around here. What's uh? We don't have a spade. The stone reads "Not dead, only sleeping." Buried me anyway. Unlucky. Great, just let me out. This grave says, "I finished before you in the human race." It's very metaphorical, actually. We can't get down here, I don't think yet. We got a lot we need to investigate, really. So we'll uh, we'll check all that out later. But what's going on in here? I probably should have uh, looked at the big red spirity thing on the door before I just walked in. It's going to be filled with undead, isn't it? Or like, you know... Well... <laughs> oh no! It's the undead! If only they weren't incredibly slow! <laughs> the undead are such a risk for us! It's a shame that we can use our bow to dispatch them from the stairs, isn't it? Oh no, this one's getting a little bit close. Close, he's getting feisty. Oh. Fellas, it's like shooting fish in a barrel at this point. There's more. They're coming up the stairs. Hand-to-hand -hand combat engaged. <laughs> I'm just doing this for the guile skill. There we go. Not guile. Uh, skill. Whatever it is. There we go. All right. Oh, you know what? At the end of the day, I want we can just probably go up here, go around the back of the stairs, do this. There we go. Problem solved. At the end of the day, this is always a win-win situation. What's happening now? Oh, something's rustling on around the back. That grave. But we don't have a shovel, do we? I said we should buy a shovel, and everyone said no. And at the end of the day, who was right? Me the beard. There's a bed up here that we can't use, which is a shame. Some experience. Lots of, you know, items. Ages of skill. What's going to be hidden in the clock? Ages of... No. <laughs> There's no ages of might hidden around, unfortunately, so we don't get all the three skill sets. We only get, you know, a couple of them. Anyway, dusty notebook. The Talon Clan leg tattoo. We'll probably want that to go with our absolutely hideous look. You know, we are quite a hideous looking fella. Let's see what's going on down the bottom of the garden, shall we? There is a fairy thing. Alright, let's find out what's going on here. I mean... Oh, damn, we should probably do something about them. Oh, they're one... Oh, no, they can take more than one hit to kill. Ah, no, I want to aim. Well, that went bloody well, didn't it? We're better off just, you know, whacking them a few times and hoping for the best. And I'll sod this. We'll use this spell again. It's a win-win situation. There we go. They hate it when you do that. How is it still alive? Oh, come on. Where's it going? Where's it going? I can't actually see because it's clipping around so much. There we go. Sod off. Perfectly done. Alright, let's see. We need a fishing rod, actually. We haven't done any fishing-related quests. Have we actually even been to the fisherman's hut? We need to go. Unless there's extra... Oh, but then there might be extra quests. We'll head to the Heroes Guild. You know, we'll take some extra quests. We want our big fuck-off sword. It's what we've been trying to get for a long time. We want the big sword. Okay, we'll head to the Heroes Guild. And we will uh, we'll speak to you, actually. How are you doing? Your sister left a quest card for you. I suggest you take it. Okay, mate. You're always so pleasant. Rescue the archaeologist from Bowerstone Jail. Oh, we'll do it, but we're not happy about it. And we already had to murder everybody in bloody another town. Yes, we'll do it naked. We'll... Oh, that's difficult. Whoa, take no damage. Sod off. All right. Is that the trader again? Oh, hey. I'm looking for someone to take me. He's just. We aren't. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I just found that funny. You know, he's been he, he he keeps giving us like no cash, so he deserved a bit of a punch in the face, didn't he? That wasn't that unfair, was it? It was it was like a nice thing to do. Because you know how much we appreciate him. And by that, I mean we don't appreciate him at all. So we'll head to Bowerstone, uh, and we will um, 
We'll head, uh, what was it? We needed to get a new, a new mustache or something, wasn't it? We need to get mutton hey, chops. Do you have any hero dolls? Why is your voice so compressed? You have? Brilliant! My teacher has a really wet doesn't let us play with it. There are seven dolls in all, he says. If you get them all, I Please see our teacher. Oh, I've only got one of them. Alright, what we'll do... Okay, it's not even open. We're gonna head out and save this archaeologist. Again. What is it with us and saving archaeologists? It seems all we ever do is run around saving nerds. It's pretty much what this game is. Nerd Rescue Simulator 2018. Or 2004. Depends on what way you want to look at it. Here we go. Hello. I'd steer clear of the holding cell. We've got a real nutcase in there. You might... Oh, we could do that. Alright, they've got a nutcase, but we already know the nutcase is the, uh, the archaeologist. So is it really all that much of a, a surprise? This place of town is lovely. Alright. Hello? Hello? Finally, someone to talk to. You're not the You've same archaeologist. Do we? The mayor's having me executed. That's what happens when you start asking. I'd have you executed. Look at his eyebrows. Here. That woman is his, a demon. His eyebrows no are going off me. his face. Just because I was wrong about the guards controlling our dreams by spiking our water supplies. Her sister was an angel. Would have this made is a wonderful mayor. Hey, look, you can see his eyebrows from this angle. They look like it. a tumor coming off his you face. Have to help me prove it. Otherwise, Bowerstone will remain in her clutches and I'll be executed. <sighs> Do you want to help the prisoner investigate the death of Lady Grey's sister? Yes, we'll yes, do it. Finally! We're going to bring that crazy witch down. All you need to do is get her dead sister to tell you what really happened. Wait, this isn't the archaeologist. Don't give me that look. We all know ghosts exist. You've seen them. I've seen them. We've all seen them. No, we haven't. Grey's sister, Amanda, had a sweetheart called Our Mohawk Audrey. once again clipping Christ into our head. Usually hangs out in barrow fields. If anyone knows how to entice her out of oblivion, it's him. All righty. Uh, listen to me. You're all doomed. Ah, I punched help, him. Help! You're part of the conspiracy, aren't you? How did I punch you him through the bars? Silence the truth. People have a right to know. How did I do that? I, I didn't mean to. Haven't you spoken to Rodri yet? I told you. You that. saw us punch you in the face. No, we haven't spoken to Rodri. What's he on? He's mental. Absolute nutcase. There were too many of them. We never stood a chance. Too many of what? They grabbed the archaeologist and took him up the hill there. All right, we'll head up I the hill there. I don't know what planning to do with him, but I bet it ain't going to be pretty. I bet it ain't going to be pretty. Oh, no, look. You've got it's Johnny to rescue Depp. Him. Quick, there isn't much time. Rescue who? Which one of them? I'm right behind you. Are you? Are you really, though? I mean, you're doing an absolutely... Oh, no. Alright, let's... I, I think I might have done more damage to the bloody guard than I did good. These guys really do know how to give you a beating. Alright. Alright. Oh, this guy looks like he's going to cause us a bit of a problem. Yeah, he is. He's going to mess us up. It would appear. At least so he wants us to believe. Let's get them right behind you. All right, we need to. We should have bought some more supplies before we started doing this, because uh, yeah, turns out that doing this uh, quest with uh, no supplies and no armor was probably not the best shout. The guards look like the guards from Dishonored. No, these guards are better guards. These are the real guards. Oh, sod off! Look at these guys getting in the way once again. And who are they helping? Absolutely nobody. Oh look. There you go. Pick a fight with the scorpion, dude. Oh, there's tons of them. I feel kind of bad that we don't have any armor now. Because it's making this a whole load harder. Alright, there we go. There we go. I'm surprised that the uh, they're actually managing to put up a fight. Should we see how this uh, turns out for them? No, I want to summon my little dude. All right, there we go, fellas. You all... Oh, you're... You, that, I'll leave them to, you know, fight it out. We've already got an ebony longbow. What is he doing? There we go. All right, we'll take out this guy. 
Oh, come on. There we go. We'll eat some food. Uh, and we will we'll shoot some fireballs at these crates and stuff. You know, because we want what's in them, but we don't want to deal with the uh, blowing ourselves up. A sheriff mustache. Now that could be good. Alright, I don't think our guards are going to make it. You know, that's sort of a given at this point. They're not very good. And I don't think they were ever going to be very good. So what's this guy going to do? He's putting up a shield. A shield? Well, that's interesting. Okay, so we need to uh, kill the minion summoner. In the meantime, we just have to use the good old tactic from the, uh, the arena. Which involves just going behind whatever exists and, you know, giving the old razzle-dazzle to the back so they can't hit us back. But, you know, in the meantime, this is working surprisingly nice. The trader-style mustache. That could look perfect. Alright. What's this guy gonna do? Yep. Alright. There we go. Got him from behind. They kept telling me they're right behind me, but it's not doing them much good. You know, at the end of the day, they're still not in the best... All right, so there's, a, there's, a couple, there's another guard over here who's having a hard time trying to give this guy the old left-right goodnight. So now all of us are in here trying to give him the old left-right goodnight, and it's uh, quite the spectacle to behold, really. Oh, for God's sake. We've run out of meats. We probably should have bought some more a little while ago. We're having to use... We just had to eat our crunchy chick, unfortunately, which is not ideal. Okay, we're now whacking this guy into a corner. We've got another guy we need to whack into a corner. Alright, sources. Now where do we have to head to? We have to head up around here and take out the summoner, dude. And the only way I can think of to do that is run straight behind all these guys because I can't be asked to deal with them. I'd much rather take out this guy. Alright, that was a mistake. Once we get over the fact that I did make a mistake there, you know, it's much better. Because everyone learns by their mistakes, don't they? And my mistakes are the fact that I can't hit anything in this game. Alright, there we go. Got a few more people. Okay, one of our guards is about to die. He's still throwing and shooting whatever it is he's doing at us. Takes quite a hit, doesn't he? Alright, give you another whack. We've got more tofu we can eat. I've somehow put away my weapons, despite the fact I didn't want to. Alright. No, don't want to target on... To say this game had targeting would be a lie. There we go. The barrier is down. Hurry through to save the archaeologists. I'll save the archaeologists in a second. I'm looting the place right now. There's an assassin. Where did he come from? He doesn't count. He's not meant to be here. Holy hell, he take... He gives us quite the... He might be the death of us, actually, this assassin. He's taking... He's giving us more of a beating than the bloody bad guys. Let's equip some, uh, you know, you know, food and stuff, because we got none equipped at the moment. What do we have the most of? We'll find out. We've got a few fish we can have. It's about the extent of things, really. We'll eat a couple of fish and hope for the best. Alright, what's going on up here? There's a uh, treasure chest. I'll have the treasure chest. I can hear a really British guard, you know. Sod off, mate. Dole of you. Nice, that looks nothing like us. But, you know, they meant well. They probably just gave it so he could find us, you know, off us in the end. We got a health potion, which is nice. There's nothing there. I don't see how he got you. Alright, we got a will potion at least. We use the will potion before we go in, because we're going to need it. I'm pretty sure there's a timer on this little section here, so we need to be relatively quick. Um, which is never the best way to go about things. But, you know, we need to get it done. And, of course, there's a rock troll. Do we have to deal with the rock troll, though? I'm not too sure. Oh, no, this section doesn't have a timer. I swear there used to be a timer along here, but... It might just be me being a bit, uh, insane. Uh, 
Okay, now this is where it's going to be an issue because I want to target on... You know, I don't want to target that. I want to... Okay, I'm going to run back on over here and leave the guard to deal with it. For God's sake. Let me blow up that thing. Come on. Alright, you can run in with your sword. You're not going to live. Come on, let me blow up the... Great! There we go. Did that deal any damage? Okay, 810! Alright, so what we want to do is we want to... We want to whack back the... Um the stones that he throws because they deliver 800 damage each. I mean, look at that. I mean, aside from the fact the guard died, you know, that was never ideal, but, you know, at the end of the day. Alright, he's round two. Oh. Yeah, this is not proving to be the, uh, the best quest for us. Maybe we were better off just, you know, Getting real close to him and whacking him to death. Because, you know, ten hits is the same as one thing. Alright, we'll get through this, fellas. Don't don't you worry. We'll get through all this. Alright. One, two, three. Yeah, there we go. We'll head on back. We want to get this quest done, ideally, before the end of the stream, don't we? Alright. He did whack us with that. I'll give him that. Alright. Oh. You know, there's, he's coming on round again, which is not ideal. Two, three, four, five. There we go. Okay. He's dealt with. Now it's just this guy we have to deal with. Oh, okay. Not fun. Not fun. Not a good situation at all. Uh, gonna try and get up. Uh, and behind him, you know, do the old attack from behind tactic, because that's that's what ends up getting them in the end. Oh, fellas. Emperor Ming is not having a good time with this. This is not as bad as the, uh, the arena, but this is a relatively difficult mission. I'm actually surprised by how difficult it is. You know, it's not proven to be an easy one, by any means. So, we'll try and get it done. We'll eat some tofu. Right, we got that done. So, wait, where have we got to go? We've got to head up around here. There's more. Oh, there's more guards. Not that they're going to follow us anyway, but, you know. They're there for emotional support, apparently. That's pretty much what the guards are here for. I can't see any other reason why they'd be here. They're not very good fighters. They don't need to do much, but... You know, Emperor Ming, Destroyer of the Galaxy, is uh, going to... Uh, deliver the smackdown on all of these guys. No matter what it takes, he's ready. He's prepared. He's having to go through an absolute crap ton of uh, health potions. Was there anything back there we need? I don't think there was anything back there we needed. Anyway, we will uh, we'll head on down here and we will head to the prison path. I'm pretty sure the prison path is the final bit. Unless there's another section after this. Hurry. No, it's not. Almost reached the boat. You're running out of time. There we go. So we got to head down to the boat now. Emperor Ming, of course, does not know what a boat looks like, given how there's a random assassin there. You know, just standing, as you do. What a guy. What a character, fellas. So, uh, this is going to prove to be rather difficult, because we need to try and get rid of all of them within five minutes. And there are a lot of guys. Uh, you know, five minutes. That's, there's more guys here than there was uh, in other situations we were involved with. So, you know, it's going to prove to be a bit of a pain in the ass at the end of the day to try and get through all this, but we're going to do it. It might actually be worth running all the way down and fighting them all in one giant bulk load, which uh, might work as a tactic, actually, so I might consider that. You know, at the end of the day, also, we're running out of health stuff. We're, we've gone through loads, purely because, you know, we don't have any armor. So, what are we going to do when our, uh, our health stuff runs out? Because these guys, they hit hard. And they, they, they don't let up. You know, we need to buy some more health potions after this mission, because... Oh, for God's sake, this guy can sod off. You know, we've already dealt with multiple assassins trying to kill us. He can go fight something else for all I care. Oh, fellas. I'm gonna run on straight past all you guys. 
you know, we'll meet you down here at the bottom. We'll fight you all down here when it's e where it's easier because you know, other than that, there's too many of you. Three minutes to take out this many guys, you know, and they hit harder, which is unfair because you know, we haven't got any stronger. We've just run out of health potions completely, you know. We haven't really got much else we can do. We're relying on goodwill and you know donations here to try and get us through. Okay, hit you. They, they, I don't like how they can still follow you around in real time, despite the fact you've slowed down time. Okay. Oh, that bloody assassin is back. Although I do think he just got whacked in the back a couple of times. Alright, we'll get rid of the assassin, because he's actually, you know, capable of inflicting damage to us. The thing is, we've still got to get rid of all of these guys. Uh, and there's a lot of them. Alright, whack you... Alright, before they try and hit us again, you know, there's a lot of them coming, uh, which is not ideal. Uh, yeah, this is going to be a close one. Two minutes, 40 seconds to take out. I have no idea how many that is because there's still two guards up there holding a lot of them. We didn't save you. There's still loads of them behind us. The music as well at the same time. It's gone so loud. Okay, well, tell us the path. There's an ancient route through the Litchfield Graveyard. There we go. We've got ourselves a plan, ladies and gentlemen. We have ourselves an idea. I'm not sticking around here. I still know a few good hiding places. I want to know where he was hiding beforehand, because there doesn't seem to be much actually here. Oh well. We've done the mission. We got nine grand out of it. It's been a solid two grand of that on health potions, probably. Silver Check augmentation. For more quests. Oh, there's the guild master. Check the guild for more quests. You've received a new quest card. What did this guy have on him? Check the guild for more quests. Okay, they've actually got some you know, crates that we can smash open. Anyway, fellas. So brings us to another hour or abouts of a stream. We've completed a few more missions. And our next stream will be a longer one. But for now, thank you very much for watching, fellas. I'll catch you all in the next one. Good night.